Hi, in this video lecture, let's discuss about one proving technique, which is proof by contradiction. In this technique, we wanted to prove that a statement P is true. For that, what we do is that we will assume P is false. And we will arrive at an incorrect conclusion. Because we have assumed that P is false, which is incorrect. So, this is a contradiction that we will meet and therefore, we will claim that P is true. We will see an example. The claim is root 2 is not rational. We will assume that this is a rational number. If it is a rational number, then we can write root 2 as some n divided by m where both n and m are integers that do not share any common factor. We will see that we cannot write such a thing. So, since we have assumed that it is rational, root 2 is rational, we have written root 2 equal to m by n by m. We will square both the sides. So, we will get 2 equal to n square divided by m square. Bring the m square to the left hand side. We will get 2 m square equal to m square. Since this is a multiple, left hand side is a multiple of 2, we know that the result is a even number. That is 2 m squared is a even number. That means what? n squared is a even number. If n squared is a even number, if we take the square root of n squared, the result will be a even. That is the property of arithmetic. If we take the square root of a even number, the result is also even. So, since n squared is even, when you take the square root of n squared, n will be even. So, we will write n as some 2k because k can be anything. Since we have a 2 as a factor, this product will be even. Now, we will substitute in the place of n squared 2k the whole square. So, 2m squared is equal to 2k the whole square which is equal to 4k squared. If you, if you cross 2 with 4, we get m squared with equal to 2k squared. Now, what can we conclude from this? 2k squared is a even number. That means that m squared is a even number. If you take the square root of m squared, what you get is a even number. So, m is a even number. Suppose if we represent m by some factor 2p. Since it is even, p can be anything. Uh, since there is a factor 2, 2p will be even. Now, n is 2k and m is 2p. That means that they have a common factor 2, which is a contradiction. To what we have assumed that n and m are integers which do not share a common factor. Factor. Now, we have arrived at the fact that or incorrect conclusion that n and m have common factor. This is because of our false assumption that root 2 is a rational number and thereby we conclude that root 2 is a irrational number. In the next video, I will come up with another proving technique. Thank you for watching this video.